thank you. Which is public health, chapter 126U, limiting the use of child restraint practices in school and treatment facilities. This has actually been on the books for several years, so you should all know this. RSA section 126U4 states, no school or facility shall use or threaten to use any of the following restraint and behavior control techniques. Any physical restraint or containment technique that A, obstructs a child's respiratory airway or impairs the child's breathing or respiratory capacity or restricts the movement required for normal breathing. This is the law, the mess ends tonight. I'm telling you right now, you better vote on it and it better be quick. Nobody else needs to speak because this is the law on the books and we got a lawyer and that's it and it's gonna be the whole entire, the whole entire state within days. It has to be optional. You can't make kids wear it. It's child abuse and it needs to end. Get it done. Thank you. Woo! Uh, Joe Breton, 1109A, Mammoth Road. I have a second grade in the school system. A lot of awesome points made. I'll try to keep it short and sweet. Basically, I want my daughter to grow up in the America that I grew up in. I want her to understand constitutional values. I want her to understand her liberty. She has the choice to choose. We, we should have the choice to tell our children if they should wear a mask if we feel that it's unsafe. With all of the real numbers that are out there, not on CNN, not on all your little bullshit fucking shit, we need yes, to please. bring it back. We need to bring back normalcy. I want my child to have an education, to not be distracted, to not be suffering oxygen. I just want my... I want, I, I want to go back to normal. We got laws, we got all these awesome points made. You have, what's the average age of, of a teacher in your school? If you're in our 30s, between 20 and 30, you're not even at risk. These children have a bigger risk of dying from the flu than they do this virus. And we're making all of, all, all of these sacrifices on a whim? What are we, what are we teaching them for their future? They're gonna go the rest of their life scared? How many flus have we lived through? How many horrible tragedies have we lived through? All through history. And we're teaching them now that, oh, there's a cold. Oh, you, you gotta run and hide and put a mask. Don't talk to your neighbor. Don't communicate. Don't congregate. Don't go to church. Don't do all, like, it's gotta end. Please, thank you. Have a great night.